All right, so uh, I actually went back to White, well, stopped the recording of the video, and then I went to upload said video because I really want to get more videos out since I'd been slacking over the past couple of days. And then I realized I had the uh, monitor, you know, audio monitoring on the OBS turned on, but the output itself was turned off. So again, there was another episode that will have no in-game audio, but that's fine. We're not here for the awesome music in this game. Why did I go through this door? We're here for me. Me and me alone. I am the most important feature of this channel. Um... Do the dry bones typically turn around like that? Because I feel like, uh... I feel like the Nintendo gods have uh, decided to... You know, screw me over personally. Like, specifically just me. That will never happen to anyone else ever in the history of the world. Just... Just me there. I'm a, I'm a little perturbed by that. I missed the Koopa again. But not that one! He was two days from retirement. What a tragedy. Alright, let's go through dorm number seven. Not six, number seven. Get, get in there. There we go. Oh, I didn't know I could jump on the fire. Oh, pfft. I was so excited for jumping on the fireballs that I jumped into his mouth there. Let's try that again. Alright, screw screw the normal jumps. Let's just do uh, spin jumps. Spin jumps henceforth. Get, get to the door. There we go. Don't know why I went to go walk into the fireball there. Don't Don't mind that. Ignore that, in fact. As I slaughter all these Koopas. Here we go. There we go. Oh, no, I went through the wrong one. Let me back up, up there. No. Again, my brain is just hardwired to being like, yeah, choose door number two. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. This is not fine. But I do get a power-up. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. I'm actually going to rewind to the proper door. I don't want to have to go through the... We, we've seen door number two enough. We don't need to see it anymore. It's fine. It's fine. In fact, I'm going to cheat a little bit. We're going to create a suspend point on save slot three. So if I feel like doing this... Like, legit, I could have the option to do so, but since I'm not feeling legit today, I'm not going to do it that way. I kind of want to start bouncing off the fireballs now, but, uh, with my luck, my skill, rather, it would not go so well. There we go, there we go. Oh, pfft. It helps if I actually jump, you know? Alright, load well, suspend point. There, it, it's basically the same as, well, I'm not losing lives this way, but this is the same as just me replaying the second door over and over and over again, because are you ever going to see me die on the second door? Have you ever seen me up to this point die on the second door? Probably not. Maybe it once or twice, because I'm bad, but uh, aside from that, no, I don't believe so. Uh, that's, gotta, gotta hold, uh, not hold it, rather press it. All right, we've made it through door number two. Let's do this. Let's do this. We got this. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. With speed and elegance. All right, this guy freaking explodes, but let's do it anyway. Yeah. Go, there we go. Just explodify all of them. I'm gonna bump into this one though, because I can use him as a uh, projectile. There we go. It's the door back here. Oh, here it is, here it is, boys. G give me a magical item. Mad uh, hidden items anywhere, anywhere, please. You can't possibly expect me to do this while tiny. 
It's not fair. What I'm gonna do, if I feel like it, we're gonna create another save point. All right, let's do it. This has been, you know, what started as me wanting to do a legitimate playthrough of Super Mario World, very, very quickly devolved into me bending and changing the rules as I go. But if that weren't allowed, they would not have given me the tools to do so. So I feel I'm in the clear. Like, just on a personal... I jumped into the propeller like an idiot, because why wouldn't I? Alright, well, we'll go ahead and go through the seventh door. Just, just to give Bowser a little, a little bit of a break. Oh. Well, that was, that was unfortunate. Go ahead and load our suspended point, because again, I don't want to go through door number two over and over. Why am I running to door number two? Force of habit. Uh, that fire came out a little bit later than I was expecting it to. Oh, God. Almost got burned. Pardon me? Can we get an instant replay on that? Alright, I'm gonna hope I'm in the middle of this pin jump and not touch anything. Oh. Okay, never mind. It didn't quite work out that time, but, uh. Alright. What if I hold it, but, uh. Okay, I'm not sure what happened there when I, like, spun jump off the Bowser, but then somehow got shoved up his ass. I have no words. Yeah. We're gonna do the same deal here. I was hoping you'd fly a bit further. There we go. All right, Bowser, I'm coming for you. And not your propellers, keep the propellers to yourself. Propellers have a hurt box. I don't know if the size of his little balloon car thing have a hurt box, though. I'm scared to try. I could try, because I could rewind, but I'm not... Well, let's try it. Okay, no... No hurt box on the sides of the cart there. Bonk. Oh, pfft. <laughs> that was probably time. I thought he'd be stunned a little bit longer. No... Door number seven. Oh, wait, I forgot. Spin jump. Spin jumps only. Let's not get eaten. Wee! Oh, oh god, I knew that was gonna happen. I knew that was gonna happen. I'm torn, because on one hand I want to do this legit. On the other hand, it'd be so much faster to simply cheese it. Cheese it! As I was saying... Alright, Bowser, let's make this quick. Make it quick. I'm really shocked that it don't give you, like, any items throughout the entire run. What's up with that? This game was so hard back in the day. Why? It's like, now get days, so I'll give you items all over the place. A checkpoint before the... I was scared to jump, and then I just ate the Koopa. They'll give you a checkpoint before the boss, between the boss, after the boss. They'll give you, like, a butt-ton of items during the boss, before the boss, after the boss. Like, games nowadays are so freaking easy. And you get go back to the golden days. Good old SNES classics here. They were brutal! Brutal beyond reason. I don't understand it. You know, I grew up playing Super Mario Kart and Super Nintendo. I try to play that nowadays, I'm like, good lord, this is terrible. I enjoyed this when I was younger? Good deal, good deal. I'm gonna let the cook get me. Oopsie daisy. Good deal. Now we teabag him. Hello? Oh, it's it's right in fire. Very 
Okay, this gets a help! Oh, give me that item! Give it, give it! Hallelujah! Thank you, Princess Toadstool. I'm forever in your debt. Alright, alright. Cannonball! I knew that was gonna happen. Yeah, I should've... Should've not held the jump button, just kinda glided off the cannonball there. Oh, that's not gonna hit. Oh, and it got knocked away. Plus the other Koopa just despawned immediately. Tragedy! Kinda can't believe that there's not a, like, Bowser's skin recolor in Brawl, or not Brawl, in Smash Brothers that uh, pays homage to this Bowser specifically. Oh, that was dumb. Don't ask me why I thought I could bounce off the cannonball normally. Because I can't. Alright, let's do it! This is the run. This is the run. This one is one that will actually uh, win us the game. I love that little floaty thing though. It looks so freaking happy. Alright, give me, give me the Mecha Koopas! Yeah, yeah! That was probably time to my part. I agree, Bowser. Thank you for handing me more. Oh, that, oh, that one was all on me, because I was not even sort of concentrating on Bowser and his balloon there. I was looking at the Mecha Koopa and the Mecha Koopa alone. Here he comes! I love the uh, looking up animation, or the sprite. It is an animation when it's moving like this, but it, just the sprite itself. So whimsical. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. Oh, I should have let it wait, let it go. Alright. This is the run. This has to be the run. It will be the run. Trust the process. You can't see me. We're invisible. I've mastered the art of standing so perfectly still. Just like Drax. Good deal. I was really nervous there for a second, but uh, I think I'm doing alright now. Now I just need to get the mushroom, not jump into the cannonball like an idiot. You know, I thought I was for far enough away that I wouldn't get hit by that. I was sorely mistaken. So much for my mushroom theory. Alright, let's, let's do it again. Is this going to be the run? Maybe. I'm starting to have my doubts, but maybe. Alright, let's do it! Give me the mechs! The mechs! Is it Mecha Koopa or Mech Koopa? I couldn't tell you. I just got bounced. Like an idiot. He doesn't know it was me. I'm hidden. You can't see my little butt poking out of the side of the brick there. It's fine. Alright, I'm definitely safe from here. Yeah! Thank you! I'll survive! But now I really can't hide. It's 
Let's actually stand over here and let him drop the cannonball down that way. Give me more room to breathe. Alright, we're doing we're doing good. This is fine. This is fine. Alright. Alright, so I gotta kind of guide him to the Koopa. Gosh darn it. Jump too high. Oh, oh. Wait a sec, wait a second. Oh, there that goes. Can I have more? Please, sir. Can I have some more? Thank you. That was kind of a... That was kind of a miss! No! Alright. Let's do it one more time. One more time for the folks watching at home. Live and in living color. Not even sort of live. I don't stream on Twitch. But if I did, I've totally got a channel you could follow me at. Wow. I don't agree to that. See, I, I've hit the desperation phase. No! That was my Mecha Koopa! I was going to call him George! And you just annihilated him and I got eaten by his brother. Gosh darn it. Alright. Come on, Bowser. I need to do this. For my country. For my people. And for their people. With other countries. For world peace. Be George and Jose. George is freaking dead, but Jose still got it. Yeah, my man. Look, I'm wave dashing. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I was right there. Gosh darn it. I had it! Hello, Bowser. It's the same song and dance. This is a tale of perseverance. And how much punishment I can take before I fully abuse the suspend menu down there. Get! Get me! Ah! Oh. Ah! getting worse at this. Alright, alright, alright. We get it, we get it. Hand me the mechs right now. Right this instant, young man. Please. Please. I need them. No! Gosh darn it. Let me not be right directly underneath that for a minute. Thank you. Don't wake up. He woke up! Gosh darn it. I missed. There we go. Now I've kind of got ammunition, maybe, for the future. That's pretty sweet. Unless he walks off screen, I don't know. Oh, I was hoping that would disappear. I don't. I don't want it. I don't. No. I gotta. I gotta suspend menu abuse. Like, like I said. Like, like I said. Like, gosh darn it. Oh, I can spin jump off of those. This changes everything! I'm learning so much. 
And I got a free hit because I had the Koopa spare. Excellent. Alright, this is the run. This has to be the run. I might not even have to save Scum here. It's possible. Unlikely, but possible. Alright. Give me the Mecha Koopas. Mecha Koopa! Gosh darn it. Good. Next phase. Final phase. Final phase. Alright, now that I know I can spin jump off of these, this isn't so bad. Oh. It's a lot better if I can actually land on them, though. Just saying. Thank you. Would have been funny if like, I could jump right over it and, uh. Oh god! The pogo stick time. Jumped over the mushroom and then just floated off screen. I would have cried just a little bit. Oh, he took my Koopa. And then I took the Koopa away as well. I'm stuck here. No. All right, that's right. Those are Koopas out. I'm getting ping ponged. Oh, th that actually hit. And that was it. See you guys first try. I'm the best in the world. Look at that. That's so great. Yay! Mario's adventure is over. Thanks to a lot of save scumming. Mario, the princess, Yoshi. And his friends, all two of them, are going to take a vacation. Yay! Fireworks! Alright, we did it. We beat the game. Totally legit. This has been my playthrough of one of my favorite games of all time. Played in quite possibly the worst way I've ever played it. In the history of all gaming. Yay! But can you blame me though? I was I was freaking desperate in the end there. Well, with that out of the way, you know, this is like the first game I've completed for the channel, because I've started a lot of games and never seen them through, because I'm dumb and start off. A lot of games that take like several hundred hours to finish, so. Yeah. This one I was able to complete in a matter of days, all thanks to save scumming. It's nice. I'm a fan. In the future, I do want to come back and do this one legitimately without the save scum feature, but uh, I really want to power through and see what the uh, GBA version has to offer. So, uh, with that being said, I think I'll cut the video here because you don't really need to see the credits, but you do need to see the special thanks to these following peoples. Look at them. Look at them all. What great human beings that brought us this game. My childhood. Look at that producer. Miyamoto. I wonder what he did. I wonder if he's done anything recently. Probably just faded away into obscurity. No doubt. Definitely not one of the the top guys in the industry nowadays. Of course not. Not like he was back then. Yay! Look at that! Look at this! This is beautiful! This is what I saved Scum so hard for. Yoshi and all his Yoshi friends and all these baby Yoshis. Look at the babies. Yeah! Thank you, dear player. And you, dear viewers. Look at this. Look at this all-star cast. The lineup here. I hate the amazing Flying Hammer, brother. 
Charging Chuck is also a menace. Cost me many a Yoshi back in the day. Never saw the sumo guys, because uh, we skipped most of the uh, game. Like, 75% of it. Never saw Bonsai Bill, because I think I skipped every level that had him. Uh, I think I skipped a couple of Rex levels as well. Definitely didn't counter any of the Dino Rhinos or the Dino Torch. Saw all those guys. Never came across the Blarg, though. I was fortunate in that I uh, did not play any castles with Blarg, because those are not a fun time. All those are called Blurps? I didn't know that. So I'm used to, like... Oh, Fish and Boo. I hate Fish and Boo. Fish and Lakitu isn't fun either, but Fish and Boo is a menace. Uh, even the ball and chain gets his own honorable mention here. This game went all out. Resnor! Look at this colorful cast of characters that we skipped over entirely. Mecha Koopas, yeah! That's what they are. Look at all these people. Alright, there you have it. Good stuff. So yeah, in the future I'm definitely gonna revisit this. I don't know if it's gonna be anytime soon, but in the future I for certain want to do like a full legitimate playthrough of Super Mario World on the channel. This one was just kind of done for fun and to test out recording software and uh, then I learned that there was a remaster so I want to check that out so I really want to breeze through it in that case so uh, yeah that's what inevitably wound up to or led to me doing all the saves coming so yeah uh, now that this is complete I uh, will cut recording here I hope to see you in the next one uh, where I will probably be playing the uh, remaster GBA edition, or whatever that is called. See what's different there, see if there are still the same secret areas to exploit. And, uh, maybe I'll start playing some other stuff on the, uh, Switch Online, uh, not browser, browser's not the word, catalog. Because uh, I'm sure there's some hidden gems in here, and I know for a fact that they've got the, uh, GBA Fire Emblem, which I love dearly. I've been wanting to play that for the channel. I don't know if it's something I really want to do because that is a very dialogue heavy game in most parts and I don't think the gameplay itself is all that engaging for a viewer. But what do I know, you know? It's like, you never know what the people want. I don't even know what I want. But it, it's something I would I would want to play in my own time so might as well record it. If, it. if it gets an audience, that's cool. If it doesn't, oh well. It's for me anyway. But, uh, yeah, with all that being said, thank you very much, and have a nice day. I'll maybe see you next time, and if not, uh, my screen is fading to black. All right, it's time to wrap it up. We're done here. We're not live anymore. <laughs>